Certainly an area where we know Berlin and Beijing share common ground. And really, Germany's been at the forefront of uh, calls to keep the Iran deal in place. And only uh, recently, the German Chancellor visited Russia to uh, shore up its support for the European uh, stance on this. Now, Europe certainly doesn't want uh, Iran to be building up nuclear weapons on its doorstop anytime soon. But also for Germany, uh, trade has increased between uh, the two countries since the sanctions were lifted in 2015 and are now uh, valued at around three and a half billion dollars. And for China also, we've talked in the past, uh, the amount of business that is done between uh, China and Iran. And of course, China is a major importer of Iranian oil. So really, there's not any big surprise here that uh, they're standing uh, together on the issue of Iran. What we are waiting to hear uh, more details on is uh, how Germany and China intend to protect uh, businesses and banks also from these U.S. sanctions. Uh, there are things being talked about uh, like legal channels and also uh, through the use of non-U.S. dollar-based uh, clearing systems for doing trade. Uh, so we're still waiting out to hear uh, more details on that. Trade is very much at the center of the uh, visit and uh, Germany is in fact in a little bit of a difficult place uh, with China at the moment. As we know, China uh, just in the last few days agreed uh, with the U.S. that it would increase uh, imports of U.S. products products to uh, address the trade imbalance. Now, uh, Germany, being China's biggest trading partner uh, in the European Union, uh, feels that this could be to its detriment and uh, that we're talking about a lot of business at stake here. So. Uh, these are going to be slightly delicate uh, negotiations with the Chinese leader uh, where the German leader is going to be ask, asking for assurances uh, for China to continue uh, to do business with, with Germany, but at the same time asking for it to uh, make commitments or so concrete commitments on uh, its uh, proposals to open up and to level its uh, uh, playing field for doing trade in the country.